CES is back in Las Vegas, and Fox 5 photojournalist Kyle Oster shows us around. It's disappointing and not surprising where we are, but this is still an important show. Everywhere I turn my head, there are world-class companies everywhere. We're all masked up. We're all being cognizant. We're happy to be here, and we're excited to talk to these companies about what we can do for them. We have really, really been looking forward to this event. It's great to see people in person again. It's been a long time. Um, so we're really looking forward to just getting to know other exhibitors and the attendees and getting a, a bunch of good face time. Oh, I crashed. <laughs> it's the right place for us to really talk about not only the vehicles, but we will share a lot of technologies that we have in our cars. I think that's one of the great things about this show is that we get boots on the ground to see what's out there and to see what the next best thing is. I think we were going through what everybody else is going through, right? We want to be here. We want to talk to these companies. I think we all want live events to come back and we're looking for a way to do it and uh, make sure that our employees feel safe and they feel comfortable being here and that we're protecting everybody and following the rules so that we can have the conversations that we've all been missing face to face. There are lots of really exciting job opportunities in the unmanned technology field. The EVs and our cars, for example, it's the smart cars and it has a lot of technology in it. It's really the, the trend and, and for a better future, a greener future.